My name is Ken, and welcome back to my continuing satisfactory series on Update 8 Experimental. This is episode 10, and if you'd like to catch up from the beginning, a link to episode 1 is in the description. In this episode, we're going hard drive hunting, launching the space elevator, and building our first refineries. This episode takes an unexpected turn you won't want to miss, so let's get started. This is episode 10, and as you can see, we have our mega starter factory rolling. I am doing a little bit different setup than maybe something you've seen before. And this is, you know, more like a, a bus system and it's vertical. So we have our assembler and manufacturer row, constructor row, and then over here, the smelter row. Now, I'm not going to go over it in too much detail today. I believe that episode eight at the beginning has a pretty detailed rundown of kind of how it works. But I'm just going to show real quick so you get an idea. And then here is our central storage that we're working on. And it's coming along nicely. And then really quickly, the underfloor, which we spent the last two episodes really working on and, and getting under control. We can move around down here. We can see. We really played with the lighting. We went through a lot of iterations. If you're interested in lumen and lighting and the signs and how we did this recess lighting and this top down lighting for these guys there, then check out episodes, I think six and seven, I want to say. We just built the machines for a versatile framework and automated wiring. Unfortunately, you know, we, we kind of build the minimum amount, really just one of each. And so what we're going to need to do is give ourselves some time for those to fill up because we need quite a few to advance the space elevator. So we, we got a ways to go, right? We need 100 of those. I guess that's not too bad. And 500 of those when we already have uh, over 150. So it's not too bad. Not not too bad. However, there's some things that we can do in the meantime that we need to take care of so that we're ready to hit the ground running when we launch those space elevator parts. And that really comes down to hard drives. So today is going to be an exploring episode where we've got we're going on a hard drive hunt. We're going to be spending quite a bit of time away from the base, which is why I wanted to show what was going on. I've already sort of planned the route a little bit. But let's kind of outline it where we're headed. Uh, so here's where we are on the map. So the first one's going to be up here. And then we're going to move over into this unexplored area. And there's quite a few over here, depending on how we do and if we have time. There's a couple more down here that are actually, I think I remember being kind of scary. So we might head home, drop off, and then maybe go back to the, down here. But we're going to basically make a big circle. I think we're set. Let me just make sure of everything we need. Plenty of rotors, plenty, uh, all the all the motors that we have. I think that's enough. And then plenty of building materials to reach high places. And then our weapon, our novelists, a gun, and we're loaded. Okay, so first is pretty much straight north from us. And I don't think we even need to touch the ground here. So we're going to... We're going to build ourselves a little highway. I guess we can kill him. He's pretty cool. If you guys haven't seen the new guys, they are they are something else. If you don't know while parachuting, you can ramp up any environment slopes you'd normally slide down and catch air. Cool. Yeah, I actually don't have any parachutes. I should, though. Hey, where's where's our friend? There he is. I think that's the new guy. Miss. He's got a really cool sound when he dies, though. So we'll be able to.
There's our hard drive. Let's get out of the radiation. And what is over there? I don't see anything. Are we relatively safe? Oh, no, we got a, a little friend. Heavy modular frames. Nice. This is a score. More of them. AI limiters, which I have plenty, but I'll always take some. I don't really need to carry around any more wire. And here's our motors. And our first hard drive. Let's mark this on the map that we have this one. Because we can't really do much until we let the space elevator parts build. So we are storing up hard drives and we are not researching them because I want to go for the heavy residue, the heavy fuel residue or whatever it's called. OK, what's next? Next is we're heading, let's see, south west to roughly this area. Maybe we can put our marker ahead of time and we'll highlight it and there we go all right this will help there's our coal plant from a distance that looks cool maybe i'll take a picture out here for a thumbnail this is how a fix it employee explores there he is there's our target let's see if i can kill him from up here oh nailed He's not one of the new, new guys, but he is the big version of the hog. Oh, come here, bud. I just want to talk. Oh, I got too close to the bees. These damn bees. All my deaths are related to bees. triple Ooh. what are we doing here we're doing more motors that's why these two right off the bat I knew were motors so I wanted to make sure we grabbed everything we had all right um yeah we'll take we'll take uh computers that looked like circuit boards <laughs> did you see that <laughs> yeah those are definitely computers those those are not circuit boards. All right, what's next? We are, I think the next one is an easy one and it should be right there. All right, three down. Um, I think I have 11 charted out for this trip oh computers that look like circuit boards again we're making good progress okay next one is i think right here oh my god bean you scared me how many do we need 30 Oh, we just need one. Bam, baby. What's next? Next is pretty far away. It is in this area. So I'm just going to put us in that direction. There's something about this game. I mean, obviously, it's in the name, but... Um, there's definitely something about this game that is just, it's hard to put into words. Uh, yeah, now we have a decently long trip to the south, mostly south with a little bit to the east. So we'll keep on going and pick up any plugs we see and, you know, 
exterminate any vermin that we feel like exterminating. Prime of life. Oh, I, I, 100%. I, I'm mostly just making jokes because I'm almost 40 and, you know, I might be losing a little bit of hair. And so it's how I, you know, it's how I cope with it. This actually, I haven't thought about this until this very moment, but you might say that this YouTube channel is perhaps maybe my midlife crisis. I just, I just had an epiphany, guys. All right, we have a friend. I don't know if he's one of the new guys, but he looks big. So let's see if I can. Oh, so close. Almost a headshot. There we go. I just want to like, you know, loosen up the pickle jar a little bit before I jump down there and oh, you know what? He's going to definitely be better at range than me. I don't know if he's the new one of the new guys or not, to be honest with you. He might just be the big version of the old guys. He didn't seem like he had that much health. Okay, we've done... How many hard drives do we have? We have eight. We're just destroying our the, the, the goals for today. I think we need to go up on this plateau, and I think that we might be able to get there easily along this area. So... I think I'm going to go the long way. Oh, we have a, a friend. So, commenter told me to build a splitter to stand on, and then they can't hit you. So I'm going to try. All right. 50 megawatts. So... There we go. I had no idea we'd be getting through these hard drives so fast. My general plan for the stream kind of ends after getting these hard drives. All right, what is, wow, what is Bean over there like sprinting away from? There must be something scary over there. I don't wanna go over there now. Let's see, the next one, the last one that I had on my list really is about right here-ish. Oh, it's up. I can see it. I can see it. So we're gonna, we're gonna build. Much easier. No need to reinvent the wheel. Really? Really game? All right, I'll try. Well, that was All right, nobody nobody saw that. That was that was horrifying. Right into the poison. I fell I've fallen into their trap. And this is just getting worse. All right, awesome. Max viewers and that's what I do. That, talk about an unforced error. So, yeah. No, 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 I, I said this before. All I'm doing right now is I'm testing the new update eight feature 
of respawning with your equipment. I just, I wanted to test that for you guys. <laughs> so there's a delay. Uh, not like an intentional delay. It's just like a lag between <laughs> when I see, when what you guys see, and then when I see it, and uh, that, I just getting the chats of, of me dying. It's funny. I knew it. I, I talked about how well things were going, and it, it cursed me. I was like, oh, yeah, I, uh, I, I overplanned. Uh, we're doing this way faster than I thought. Yeah, and then I, and then I do that. Where did I die? It's down there somewhere. Somewhere. Okay, here's that poison that I was in. All right, good to know. And here's our Ethereum stuff. Where is our crate? Is it down there? Now I don't know. Probably. Okay, it's over here. We're looking for a dead body crate. Because, of course, we are. Harvest it. Where is it? Is it up? All right. Oh, I still don't know where the crate is. Maybe it's maybe it's much lower. Oh yes! Achievement unlocked. But I'm sure that our crate, our crate must be down there. So. My crate has got to be down here. There's the ladder. That I built to get to the Caterium. Oh, it's over here. I don't understand. But I want to find it. It's got all our hard drives. <laughs> Now, where the hell is the crate? Looks like we're right on top of it. Or, you know, it's on top of us. But I think I was up there. All right, well, we're going to leave a mess of ladders around. But we're going to find this because it has like nine hard drives. You guys thought you were going to see some factory building. Joke's on you. You're just going to watch me die and look for my crate for an hour. Getting a little dicey around here, guys. <laughs> it's got to... I fell a very long distance. I don't understand where it is. See, there's my boxes. There's my storage boxes that I built. Huh. I don't understand. Let's try a different approach. Let's go around to where we were last time. And then maybe we can... Maybe it's on a, like a little ledge or a cliff or something. Never eat while swimming. Hey, I'll watch this uh, Satisfactory streamer. Log in, tune in, and see this. <laughs> it's okay, it's very relatable. We were on our last one. It's literally our last hard drive. I can't believe it. I totally jinxed myself. We're going to find this. I don't know, is this, is this good Satisfactory content? 18 people helping me look for a box. You're not going to find this on Bits' stream, I'll tell you that. <laughs> you know, bite your tongue. I I hope my eight hard drives are not under the map. 
I was thinking, yeah, if they if it's under the map, I'll just spawn them out. I was thinking if uh, we find a little crystal or I mean a little um, quartz along the way, I could just knock out some crystal real quick and grab that hard drive and then look for the box. But I haven't seen any. Speak of the devil. Advanced game options. Okay, I could do that. Good point. I forgot. New update 8 thing. So I definitely could do that. Let me make sure. Two quartz crystal. So this should be enough to unlock that hard drive. So let's let's finish our our task. I mean, this is all I needed to do. I was being stupid. I was actually thinking that like I don't know, I was being stupid. Learn from my mistakes, kids. All right, do we have any friends? We do. Do I have any ammo for this? We don't. <laughs> hi. Hi. No, I don't have any cable. Oh, there's some cable. <laughs> uh, so the plan was to store up a nice big hoard and then pop the space elevator and then and then roll the dice. But alas, our plans have been interrupted. Okay, well, okay, that's been solved, at least. Now we have to find the other nine hard drives that I pissed away. All right. Is uh, one of those guys going to come around the corner and... Hit me in the back and shove me off the cliff? Maybe. And then I ran through the poison cloud. I was freaking out about it. And then I fell. I, I, I'm worried that it actually is under the, um, under the map. But let's see what we can see. Can we get one place that isn't poisony? Where I can stand and heal? Still over there. Uh, yeah, guys, it, it, we may have, have uh, lost all of our stuff. Because there's my boxes I built. And I'm pretty sure that's where I died. You know, right now would be a really great time for a parachute. Ken, you moron. And, you know, here it comes again. But we had full health. So it, it should be here. I mean, this is, this is where I landed. Damn. Eight hard drives in the toilet. So I'm going to, I'm going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and, and turn on. I wonder how, if we can for sure know that it's underneath the map. Well, thank you, Coffee Stain, for providing a way for me to not like totally feel like raging. Yeah, I I don't know. I um I think we're I think we're boned. Like I said, you guys will get to see me use the advanced game options and give myself uh let's count them. All right, so we did this one. We have this one in hand. But we did we'll go backwards. We did 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 eight nine so we had nine and then uh, i have number 10 in the inventory currently 
I'm sad, guys. I'm I'm super, super sad. Crate lands wherever your body is when you respawn. If your body rolled off the ledge by the crates, it could be lower. Okay, so let's bank this hard drive, right? Let's not have any repeats, repeat mistakes. The crate, wherever your body respawns, not where you necessarily die. Okay, I got it. I just want to try one more time before we throw in the towel and spawn in those hard drives. There's another option, guys. A little scummy. But we could pull an autosave. I don't know if I want to do that. I'd rather actually show you guys. I don't have full health. <clears throat> so that's why we dropped off our... You know what? This is a good test. We died right next to the effing thing. So, okay, there's the crate. I wonder... I mean, there's the crate, right? I don't remember seeing that when I respawned. Says it's right there. Yeah, I, I don't know, guys. Um, I don't see it down here anywhere. Nor do I see... And it doesn't say it's here, unfortunately. It says it's there. All right. One more try. Yeah, because this is the... Well, I mean, we can see where I fell, right? I fell... I fell here-ish, and then I fell and I ran through all that poison. What I will be interested to see on my recorded, the recording, what happened, and see if it actually, like, spawned. Actually, I do have an idea. I could stop my, because I record while I stream. All right, I'm going to just check this one last time. There's no way it's here, because we, we were here. We've looked through this. I'm sure that this is where I, I, I died. But I do have a quick idea. I could um, break up my recording because I record for a video on top of my stream. All right, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm not going to stop streaming. I'm just going to stop recording. So we just watched the video of me respawning. Okay, I know where it is. I'm not, the, the box is in the wall because I fell and then my body fell through more of the cliff. Now I'm wondering if maybe we can get close enough to it. Like if we do that, like that's okay. That's where it's going to be. See how we can see in there. We can like glitch in there. We're going to be able to find it. We can do this. Little did I know this is what the content would be today. Can we, can we flash? Oh, we can flashlight in there. Okay. We may not be able to retrieve it, but we're going to find it. If I can get up this hill. Come on. Come on. Give me a, give me a, let me find a place. Okay. I don't see it, but I bet you it's in one of these. Yeah. Look, I mean, look at it. It's right there on the map. Come on, let me see in there. Oh, crouch. Crouching. Okay, so I'm crouching, and that's letting me see inside more. I feel like, did you guys ever play Wolfenstein? Oh my god, is that it? That's it. Can you see it? I can't mark it, but there's a, a little round... Uh, oh my god, that's it! <laughs> okay, so there's a little black. Let me see if I can point the light at it a little better. Ah, oh, there's got to be a better spot. It's there. I can see it. I don't know how to indicate it to you guys. It's 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 right there. See the shine? There's a shine. I don't know if I how I would possibly get it. But um, at least we know it exists and the mystery is solved. Uh, okay, that'll work. 
If I jump into this hole. There it is. See it? There she is. I don't th I don't think there's any way I can possibly get it. I'm trying to like slide jump in there. But it's not working. Yep, there it was. Oh, so sad. Okay, well. There's really no option to get in there, I don't think. So we're gonna, um, we're gonna move on. Uh, but, you know, learn from my mistake, people. I can get, you think I can get it? Some tools might let the camera clip more. Yeah, I... I don't know. I don't think I can get it. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. One more time. Where was that place we looked? We looked in here. Hyper tubes. Uh, that's a good idea. The fly cheat. Um, no matter what, to get these hard drives, we're gonna have to do something. It's right there. It's it's so close. It's it's like right on the other side of this. It's right here. I know, I know. Chat be like, no. Oh, it's so frustrating. It's so close. With advanced game options. Okay. Alright, so if we're gonna use advanced game options, let's use them first to try to recover the crate. And then if we can't recover the crate at all then we'll use them to respawn the hard drives. I think I think that's good. I think that is a, a good plan. Let's try this. Let's 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 save our progress. Where is our advanced game option? Yes, okay. Enable advanced game settings. All right, here we go. Okay, you are about to load your save with advanced game settings enabled. Please note that editing these settings is a one-way action and you will not be able to switch back to the default version of the game other than reloading a previous save. All players in this session will have access to these settings once activated. If you want to proceed, press OK to continue with loading your save file. For science! And hard drives. Okay. So I'm assuming that they're here. Okay, all right, gameplay. Not, oh, flight mode. I, I don't know why I couldn't see it. All right, okay, now how do we use it? Double tap spacebar. Yep, you're the, you're the man. Um, and honestly, I'm gonna absolutely use this probably to get shots of my um for uh for the channel oh oh we got it <laughs> oh, we got it that's amazing now the 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 irony is that like we totally could have done this if i had built the platform in the right place but i mean okay okay I don't want to, I don't want to have a corrupt. Okay. This is what we're going to do. Okay. This is what I want to do. Oh, I'm, I'm super excited. Okay. We're going to go back. We're going to go back. Okay. We're going to, we're going to load, reload this, this game. Cause now we know, we know how to get there and we're going to get there without the advanced. We use the advanced game settings to make sure they're not on okay, they're not on so we used it to scout okay and now we know what to do now we're gonna do it we're gonna do it in vanilla though okay so we know what to do i'm gonna grab some materials we're gonna go back to our spot and i'm gonna build a way to grab it without having to use fly mode. Now, the only thing that gives me a, a doubt now that I, I 
I did this, is that somebody mentioned that fly mode actually lets you interact with things from a farther distance. So if that's what enabled us to get the box, then then we'll be a little bit SOL and we'll have to redo what we did. But I think it's worth it to see if we can try. Just, just try. Because if we can, then this, the, the recovery will be truly, truly legendary. Okay. So we got what we need. Let's go do this. Let's make this happen. Now, we're, we're, we're literally on the other side of this wall. Okay. So we flew into about this spot here to, to get the crate. It's got to be up. Right, I think because I think it's up. All right, so what are we gonna do? We are gonna build uh, some ramps into the wall a bit, so we have some options. And then, okay, this is how we'll do it. We'll just take it one level up at a time, one meter at a time. Okay, we'll, we'll try to use what we what we can. We'll try to do what we can. All right, and if we can't, then we'll, we're going to take it up a level. Okay. Okay, there we are. Okay, there we are. So it's right at the edge. Oh my god, I, I know I'm close. I'm so close, but we came in at an angle. Okay, so this, so this is beveled, right? So, and if we want to close the distance, we need to, we need to come at it from top down a little bit more, which is how we did it with the fly mode on. Oh my God, it's so close. Not close enough. Uh, it's so horrifying. Okay. Maybe, maybe it's still blocking. Maybe this one's still blocking. Try it again. I know, I know, I'm looking for the collect button. I mean, if I see the collect button, I don't, well, I'm not stopping. I'll, I'll, I don't care. I'll stream all night. We're, we're, it's gonna happen. The idea of the hyper tube was actually a really good one. The only thing that makes me nervous about that, that's actually a really good idea. I don't have the materials, but I could go get them. Okay. All right. We know where it is. We've tried that a bunch of times. Let's make ourselves an easy way back. And let's, uh, I like experimenting with the hyper tube. The, the real problem is, is <laughs> we, if we glitch ourselves into the wall, what happens if um, we can't get out? Let's make sure that okay we're good we're definitely gonna need that so let's get these i also wonder if i make a wall right against the wall right against it make a make a, a built wall right against the wall if you know like that Go ahead and move, remove this for now. And then we build hyper tube wall hole. Okay, and now we build support. I don't know. I'm 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 just spitballing here. Entrance, yes. Now we need power oh damn it we didn't bring any um all my biofuel wire damn it oh i like that yeah yeah yeah. okay so if i can clip inside grab the stuff and then i can't get out i could always stand right next to it and then kill myself closer so the that box is <laughs> easier to grab it's like when you uh i don't know the joke when you send in you know you send in a snake to get the rats and then the, the the snake kills the rats, but then uh, what do you send in to kill the snake? Now you got a snake in your wall? 
Okay, we got power. Oh, oh, we did it! You guys, we did it! We did it. Okay, well, first step, we gotta get the fuck out of here, but we did it! Okay, all right, what a, <laughs> All right, let's make sure we get the hard drives, and uh, let's make sure we get our stuff. What do we got? We got the hard drives, we got them! Okay, let's get the let's get the stuff the the valuables. All right, let's get rid of this extra stuff. It worked first try. Whoever said the hypertube, you said it like way a long time ago. I should have I should have done it. That was brilliant. I was thinking maybe we leave it as a monument. You guys want to? Okay, you guys decide. You guys decide. Should I should I take everything or maybe just like leave, just like iron rods right and and leave the crate as like a monument what do you, it's your it's your guys is uh you decide monument oh uh, hey you know who gets to decide is uh i think cja right he he got the idea what do you think should we leave it i think we should leave it that's what i'm leaning towards and then we'll always remember all right he says monument okay okay Part is step done. Now, how do we get out of here? Okay. I think we go out the same way we came, maybe. Noodle. Oh, auto 2D. Um, oh, we could just leave. We can leave this in. Um, and then hypertube entrance. And then can I connect power? That's it. That's it. <laughs> we're definitely okay. We're definitely gonna um. Uh, we can't. We don't want to leave that as a monument. Um, we're definitely, definitely going to leave this area. This this stays. I'll build some stuff around it, and and we can always go in and see our crate. There's our crate, and then back out. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't believe. I cannot believe we did it. I I was going to give up. I was going to give up so many times. Okay, now let's get these effing hard drives back to base and save before I find a way to kill myself again. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. You guys, you have no idea how much like I'm like like charged up right now. There it is. Victory. Oh my god. And it almost at this point I, I'm I don't even remember what like we went out for. <laughs> it's like Yeah, that's actually ridiculous. I can't believe we, we pulled that off. Thank you. Thank you everybody for the patience and the suggestion. Wow. I mean, how do I beat that, right? That, that that was crazy. What do we got? Well, okay, we've been definitely gone long enough to launch our space elevator. So that's that's what we're going to do. We are going to victory launch our space elevator. That was awesome. I mean, I haven't been streaming very long, of course, but obviously this is this tonight's going to be a hard night to top in terms of like the fun and you know amazing things happen when you don't give up okay let's do this here we go Wow. What a what a crazy ride. This is what we're here for. Milestone reached. Oil acquisition and refining unlocked. Oil-based products can now be made. 
The byproducts of oil refinement can be used after further processing, as seen in the refinery. Caution. This is a reminder to minimize the chance of expiration during out-of-base activities. Minimize the chance of expiration during out-of-base activities. Did she say that because I've been dying? Because I feel attacked. I feel, I feel seen. Let's put our hard drives to use. The reason that we were waiting to research is so that I have actually have a chance now to get the heavy oil residue. We actually get to do a little bit of factory building today after all of that drama with our crate. And we're actually adding on in a, in a really big way here. We are gonna add the refinery line to our factory. We're gonna build and we're just gonna assume that I will get that recipe. Because we will, we're gonna, our, our oil can't go online without that, that recipe. So we're just gonna assume that we're gonna get it. Now, I've, in the past, I haven't provided ourselves enough space. So we're definitely going to try to give ourselves a lot more space. The other ones, we only gave one space. I think I'm just gonna, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and give myself three spaces. I never make enough room for myself, so we're gonna we're gonna overdo it. And this is gonna be a perfect use case for I just hit H to lock the hologram. And so now, okay, so obviously we already know that that's not lined up, right? So we just there. Now we're lined up. Um actually, I don't like that. So what we're going to do. I'll tell you in a second. We'll, we'll deal with this in a second, but we definitely need to fix that not enough room. That's too tight for sure. Because these are really long. So I just give myself way too much. Yeah, we're going to need room for the pipes. We're, we're, we have to deal with pipes, so we're absolutely going to do this. And then we're going to do that. So now we're lined up on this corner. Okay. And then we will move our merger to match the refinery instead of the other way around. Okay. Right. And then now we have lots of room for pipe work. Um, over the top of this. So this is going to go here. I think it's there. Let's check. Yep. Yeah. There it is. Okay, here we go. What are the chances, right? So this is why we waited. This is the partner to heavy oil residue the one that we want right see if you see i mean we're gonna get this one but if you look oil in and then you get polymer resin and heavy oil residue this is the one where you get more polymer resin than heavy oil residue we don't want that one we want majority heavy oil residue we're gonna get this one but this isn't what we were looking for which but that's fine it is one that i want to have so next hard drive. So I had a thought. So one thing that I have found in my satisfactory playthroughs is that I get a lot fewer fluid bugs and there it is buggy. Uh, the fluid in this game. If you uh, make a fluid uh, buffer and use gravity, make a gravity fed, like a water tower, basically. I think that's what I want to do with all of these. Something like this. Is that lined up? I think that's lined up. Let's jump over to our friend here and look. Yes, that's lined up. So that's what I'm thinking. And then I'm gonna switch over to my fluid. Horizontal to vertical, maybe? 
Yes! I knew without looking that that was going to be exactly what I wanted. So that comes together really, really easy. And it looks nice. Um, and it moves some of our infrastructure up out of the way. Um, I, I definitely, we're definitely doing this. Okay, ma'am. Okay. So this is not a great recipe. And this is a worse recipe. So we're definitely getting this one. And I actually might use this one at in this save. But yeah, that was easy. That was an easy pick. Let's start the next one. Let's build out our 40. We'll, we'll save this side. We we know we'll do some. We'll probably do like the rubber and the plastic or the or the heavy oil residue to fuel on this side. But um, yeah, let's let's build this out. Let's see how long bar 40 takes us. So let's build the first 20. We'll do half. We'll do half and then we'll expand. Let's go check on the ma'am. Come on, heavy oil residue. No. But. Not doing that. I don't want even more. I, I'm trying to remove screws. Okay. So I think I have to. I like this, this steam copper sheet. I, I think I will use the steam copper sheet for sure. This rotor is beautiful because this eliminates the last need for screws in our factory. That looks cool anyway. And, and remember, steam comes out of these when they're on, so that'll look that'll look really cool. All right, so what's the best way to ensure that we're lining up without having to check a hologram every time? The man went. We have to keep going. Okay, what do we got? Rubber concrete's interesting. I don't think we necessarily need it. A different way to make crystal oscillators is always good. Uh, we'll go with this crystal oscillator because it'll just give us more options. Okay, six left. Okay, what are we doing? We are applying our oil swatch to all of these pipes. Now, I think, can you also customize filter? Yes. So check this out. All right. I have a cust just like the delete filter, you hit G. The customizer filter, you hit G. And now I will only color pipes. So I can hold the, the color customizer and just color all these pipes. Instead of having to go and click on each one, I can just swipe past all of them and it will only color. I missed one. The, uh, the pipes. And so what I'm trying to do is figure out how we're going to do two pipes in a in a compact way. And I think it's going to look something like this. Actually, what we need to know is where our oil is. That's what we really need to know. Right there. Very, 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 very close. So all of our oil is going to come in from this direction. All right, we're going to put all these in. So I'm just double clicking. When I first would do this, I would like click here and then click like like here, right? It's such a pain in the butt, but um, you can just double click. Ma'am, that 10 minutes went by fast. No luck. We're definitely not doing that. That's a ridiculous recipe. More different motors. That would require making motors. I mean, these are all these are not the best. Um, motors is the only thing I could foresee us actually using. I mean, I don't know why I would make motors in a manufacturer when I can make them in an assembler, but I'm definitely not building screws on purpose. That's for damn sure. I think we're done here with this oil run. Oh. All 
All right, let's see. I have to concentrate for a second here. We don't need that. That's ridiculous. This could be really useful. Alternate iron wire. So we're going to... and I mean, that one's useful too, actually. Um, Actually, we're going to go with this one. This one basically makes it so that you can get quick wire with a lot fewer tearing ingots. And we actually have way too much. We have plenty over here, but we... We have more copper than we need, so that's actually relatively useful. Okay, four to go. We're um, we're more than halfway through, and we haven't hit what we're looking for. There it is, ma'am. Yeah, come on, heavy ore residue. No, not getting that. All right, we don't want that. <laughs> um, I don't know, man. Guess this one. I guess we're getting like the lamest stuff. We did get a couple good ones, so I'm not going to complain. Plus, plus, I'm really not going to complain because we got our, our hard drives back. So, two. Oh, the bam. Still no luck. This is actually a good one, I think. Uh, I think this is a cheaper way of making circuit boards. And I, I don't know about you, but I feel like we always have so much silica and copper sheets. So to me, that that's a no brainer there. That, that I think is a really good one. Two left, guys. We only have two chances left for heavy oil residue. Um, all right. Now that we're done desecrating his body, let's move on. Ma'am! Still nothing. We are not getting there. That is really bad. Cheap silica. I don't know. I don't know if we need it. This, I don't know if we need any of this. Let's, we need, we need that one more than anything else, I, I guess. Right, if we were short on quartz and there's, there's definitely one to go guys. One to go. We're gonna have to go hard drive hunting again tomorrow. Or I mean, Saturday on our next stream. Let's build our turn. And... Ma'am, last ma'am. No luck. No, no luck. We're gonna get this wire, because we've... God, we've gotten this freaking copper rotor I don't know how many times. Like four times? No luck, though. That's okay. We're gonna be doing um we're gonna be doing hard drives next time. Will this make it? I don't think I think this is too far. Yeah, it's too far. Oh my god. I have to I have to stop streaming. I'm so tired. Uh it's been it's been a long night. It's been a long night. Our emotions have been played with. And uh, I just, it's taken its toll. Yay! Finally! Success! What's the plan for next time? We have to go hard drive hunting. We need another set of hard drives because we cannot turn this on until we get the heavy mod, uh, the heavy, the heavy, mm, the purple stuff. So we're gonna go hard drive hunting. I will be more careful not to lose my crate full of 10 hard drives. Thanks again so much for watching, and it was a crazy stream and um, a lot of fun, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. This was one of the craziest things that has ever happened to me while gaming. I'm glad I was able to share it with everyone. Although we got our hard drives back, we weren't able to get the recipe we needed. This means we're going out for more hard drives next episode. If I cut out anything you wanted to see, the link to the full VOD for this episode is in the description. And if you want to watch me try to get my death crates back for an hour and a half in real time, look for my live streams. That's it for now. Until next time.